Hey, what's going on guys? When beginning this video, uh, make sure you clean them before you start sanding. Uh, rubbing alcohol and water should be a trick. And yeah, just wipe it down with paper towel. When sanding down the brake rotors, um, try not to use a rough gear like I'm using. The reason I am is because um, mine are all oxidated and they're probably going to wear out soon. And I'll probably have to replace them either way. But, uh, yeah, try to go easy on it. Try not to go too rough. You know, you might mess up the edges or whatever. Just, you know, go easy on it. Once you start masking, uh, you don't really have to since the brakes, they're going to do it for you pretty much. They're going to get rid of the excess paint and stuff. Uh, just make sure you get the caliper though. That's the most important part. And also make sure you cover the screws because if you don't, you're probably going to run into some problems when you put back the tire. You know, when you try to change the tire or whatever. And yeah, uh, when painting, uh, make sure you go for a light coat in the beginning. You don't want to go, you know too much on it because then you're just gonna ruin it and then it's gonna look ugly so just go for the light coat and then just let it dry for 10 minutes or 12 minutes and yeah in this case I used two just two coats and yeah it seems to work fine for me so yeah just let it dry for like 10 minutes 15 or what well, doesn't really matter and then just start peeling off the tape. Uh, yeah. When finished, as you can see, uh, it's not gonna be a perfect circle, but don't worry about it. Uh, your brakes uh, should do it for you. So this turned out looking better than what I expected, to be honest. Uh, I really like how it really turned out. Um, also, I will be making a video on how to paint your rims black, as you can see here. And yeah, that's gonna be it. If you liked it, uh, make sure you like and subscribe, and you know, comment down the section if you want to see more videos. Thank you.